So we're doing something. I'm not even uh, in the frame. Sorry. Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome to John, <laughs> who's trying to take over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the wine we are doing so, today. So Pierre Mottat, uh, what, what did you just stop that then introduce the bloody wine? Are you? Okay, 2017 Montpellier from Pierre Matteau. Yeah. Tell them about it. So uh, Pierre Matteau is a uh, sort of a legend. He's done the research, I haven't. So, uh, interesting. Um, so before Pierre Matteau, I need to talk about a, sort of a legendary uh, winemaker in Burgundy right now called Nicolas Patel, uh, who worked in so many different wineries like the the most famous the most uh, sort of well regarded like Rumier, that sort of stuff and then and then so he learned his craft from all these different wineries and then and they're all well respected and Pierre Motat is one of them and they're based in Morceau so they're famous for their white wine but uh from my research the red wine's cracking as well and then the the family uh traced back its history all the way back and to late 19th centuries where they 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 already came uh, like bought their vineyards in Morceau and mm-hmm. and, and just produced a stunning a stunning wine ever since and then Montelay is this sort of little village uh that nobody noticed like <laughs> uh but you can find a very good value mm-hmm. so on the nose mm-hmm. so on the nose of this really subtle it's really soft it's really delicate there's lots of um sort of raspberry flavors cranberry flavors but they're pomegranate even yeah but it's really soft really subtle and quite dry you're you're getting it's almost nudging into um sort of the pomegranate seeds rather than the pomegranate itself exactly Um, it's that sort of kernel-y sort of uh fruit I think that's what's uh, 2017 and um, doing its job is that 17 is not uh, particularly you know too cold or particularly too too ripe. Uh, it was it's sort of down in the middle, but then tends towards uh, leaning towards that sort of cooling side. And uh, as we were talking about it yesterday, it's like cool fruit. Yeah, it's uh, really elegant, approachable fruit. Yeah. 17s are drinking spectacularly well now because they've not got all that big power. Um, of the of its neighboring vintages, it's also not too cold. So all you're getting is lean austerity. You're getting stuff that is 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 really gentle and approachable yep. and enticing. Um, and I think that's what seventeen is giving yep. us. Yep. Maybe you know five ten years from now, these wines will be garbage. Yep. They won't. No, but, no. Uh, they won't. They won't. But the, 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 but then they're certainly not going to have that longevity of a hotter year yeah from a, from from you know one of the neighboring years from it but the 17s are really good and it, really drinking it, well it's it's not the sort of um wine that it's gonna give you a, a punch no no it's sort of uh, whereas some wine gives you like show their beauty all the way like just you know rip off the clothes and show you everything you're not a <laughs> doll for the love of god <laughs> and uh, but this one i'd like to apologize for my former um, colleague but, um, sorry uh, but this one you need to sort of look for the beauty <laughs> yes no, y- yes yeah you apparently i would like to dis- <laughs> i would like i would like to distance myself from well, i'm my business from all comments made by this man the bottom line is this. I'm only talking about the wine. The bottom line. I'm only talking about stop the wine. talking. <laughs> the bottom line is this. This is cracking. 2017 yeah. vintages are great. This is a lovely little wine. Um, really approachable. Really drinkable. Really fresh. Nice little bit of tannin on and it. It's sort of. And it's both of like our style of Burgundy. I think. Yeah, it's really. It's just. Sort of it's an just really, really nice. Yeah. And sometimes you want really, really, really nice. <laughs> 